things that happened during basic training was bad. Uh, I was in a two-man unit where we had a 30 caliber machine gun, really, and uh, the, my, I forget, gunner's mate, whatever we called each other, really, we had to break the machine gun down, and we went out on a bivouac where you go out in the boondocks and charge it and stay for a week and fire all the weapons that you're qualified to fire on. And 26 miles with a full pack is a lot in July in Georgia. And this mate that I had that day going out, they'd fly little airplanes over on top of you and drop bags of flour. You know, so he, those are bombs, you gotta get out of the way. And it was hot, beastly hot that day. And I noticed this kid's fatigues. You know, it's so hot down there that you get this white stripe under your arms from the salt in your system. If you didn't take the salt tablets, you weren't going to last a couple of days. And he didn't, apparently. He was a little bit overweight, really. Uh, Turnpenny, his name was, from Endicott, New York. Nice kid, and he kept stumbling and falling. You know, and he had the mechanism, too. I said, Jesus, don't get sand in there. And uh, about the third time he fell, I had devil a time to get him up. And the first sergeant came by in, in, a, in a jeep and said, Hey, we can get that SOB up off the ground. I said, I can't. He's not feeling right. Oh, he, you know, I said, look at him. He's, and his face was white then. He wasn't sweating at all. So they took him in the base, you know, taking their time really. And they put him in a tub of ice cubes and he died of shock. You know, and I thought... What the hell sort of an army is this that they treat the people like this? They were all fakers, you know. I remember that.